Alright, so today in this video, I'm going to show you how to get Director's Cut mode and why you should actually do it because it's actually something really, really cool. And if you don't have it, I definitely recommend you do it if you have all the DLCs inside of Infinite War for Zombies, of course. Uh, but yeah, why should you get Director's Cut mode? Basically, it's a cheat sheet. Like, it's basically like Infinity Ward saying, Alright, you've done this Easter egg before, you've done all the Easter eggs, you know what you're doing, obviously. Here you go. Here's a little reward. Take 25,000 points on round one. Take all the perks on round one. Have all the guns out of the box, pack a punched, on round one. That's what they're basically <laughs> telling us. So like that, that's our award. You know what you're doing. You do, you got it done. You did everything you needed to do. Here's your reward. Here's your points. Go get the map set up on round one. And it's really beautiful because it, it, you're actually getting rewarded. You're not just getting a starting pistol, another starting pistol. You're actually getting a nice reward. All guns out of the box are pack punched. Every, including the wonder weapons, I should say as well. So. I, I'm not sure about attack because of the med. You have to actually upgrade that through a process. But in Zombies in Spaceland, as you know, you stick the Wonder Weapons inside the pack Punch machine after the Easter Egg. Well, in Spaceland, now the fuses are already in the pack Punch machine. So all you have to do is go ahead and run up to the pack Punch machine after creating a Wonder Weapon. And bang, you can pack a bunch of that weapon for 5,000 points. Shoot the alien six times with the double upgraded weapon. And that alien will instantly die. Like, not even go down, he will die. Which is beautiful. And that's, it's just, it's just so cool to have. And also, the Wonder Weapons are in the box on Space Lane. There's so many advantages to getting Director's Cut modes. Let's recap. We have the every gun out of the box pack bunch. We have the alien fuses in the pack bunch machine already on Space Lane. We have all perks when we spawn in. Like I said, we have 25k points. And I apparently, we were supposed to get different starting weapons. I'm not sure if it's different on any of the other maps. It may be different after completing the Super Easter Egg. To be completely honest, I don't even remember. I'm so tired right now. But as far as I know, just including Director's Cut content... You don't get a different starting pistol in Spaceland at the very least. I don't think you I don't think you get one in any other map. But definitely like I said in Spaceland, you start out with the Kendall, but you do have 25 25k points, all perks. You can hit the wheel, get whatever gun you want out of the wheel, instantly pack a punched. And if you want to go ahead and double pack a punch it, you can do that as well, because that is available to you straight off the bat. And yeah, it's just really beautiful. So that's the reason why you should get Director's Cut mode. And like I said, all you have to do, complete every Easter egg prior to DLC 4, then complete DLC 4. Place down the key inside a pack bunch of DLC 4 after completing the Easter egg, and bang, Director's Code, Director's Cut mode will be unlocked for you. All you have to do is press R1 on your main menu, where it says Solo Match or Custom Game. When you're in that actual lobby, just click R1 to turn it on or off. You'll see it. It'll say Director's Cut mode. Uh, direct, yeah, it'll just, it'll, just, it'll just say Director's Cut, and you'll see a star. If Director's Cut is off, it will not say anything, and you won't see a star or anything like that, as you saw on the screen at the beginning of the video. And I'm trying to put it on screen now. Uh, but yeah, that's basically it. That's why you should get Director's Cut mode, because it just gives you such an advantage in the map. You can get Easter eggs done very, very early. You can get your weapons out of the way very, very early. You can get everything set up really early, and you can just have a really fun time speedrunning and going through the map just as easy as shit, and it's beautiful. So definitely, to Infinity Ward, I say thank you to this. I thank you for this, because this is an actual amazing Easter egg reward. This isn't a starting pistol. This is a real reward for completing easter eggs so definitely i highly recommend you go for director's cut mode i highly recommend you unlock it because it's going to be a lot of fun and it's going to make things a lot easier when going back in other maps and even playing with your friends and trying to carry them through an easter egg as well you have 25k points straight off the bat you can even give them points if they need it and yeah you'll be good to, you'll be good to go so definitely if you liked the video and it helped you out make sure you drop the thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to the channel for the latest infinite war for zombies dlc4 videos and streams and i'll see you guys later